guys it's Bella and welcome to Beauty on a Budget and I've been shopping again and I'm going to share it with you again <laughs> so I've got a little bit from Avon first I wanted to get a creamy um, bath wash and moisturiser and so forth because in the winter honestly I don't know if you guys find it the same but the central heating absolutely sucks the life out of my skin and my hair and everything so, um, where I normally like the Senses range, and I do, I love the Senses, but they're a little bit too crispy, springy for when, you know, your skin is very, very dry. But this one we I really like, very likes this too. This is the Avon Body Care. This is the Body Wash. And this one is uh, for very dry skin. But it's, it's really, really nice. It's the care one. And it's not got that sort of really um, citrusy. Because I found anything too citrusy in when I've got the central heating on. It just dries, dries everything completely out. So I've gone with this one. And I do like this range. And I've got a couple of those. I've got that one and I've got that one. And I'm really pleased with them. I, I love these. We've got some in the bathroom. We're both using those. Um, what else did I get from... Now, this is cranberry and orange. This is a bubble bath. I don't find this drying at all. Funnily enough, I don't find this drying at all. I really, really like it. And it's got the most gorgeous smell. I'm going to smell again as if I don't know what it smells like anyway really nice doesn't dry my skin up at all but i only put a little bit in you know i don't have loads and loads of bubbles everywhere but i have a few <laughs> but um yeah i'm liking this one so this was on offer and if it's on offer again i'm going to pick a few up because i like it as i said it was only a few bits the next thing i picked up from Avon, i wanted to try one of their roll-on deodorants this one is um what is it? Light and Blossom. Light Blossom. That suits me, I think. Light Blossom. I can't take the top off yet. You can see it's sealed all the way over. Can you even see that, guys? It's really, really nice. I smelt the... Um, my friend's got it next door and I really, really like it. So that's that one. I'm sure that'll work fine. Roland's normally do on me. I don't have a lot of problem with it. Okay, guys. Now you know that Avon also do a range called Naturals. And they're lovely too. I like that range. And I bought a body spritz, a body spray, you know, a spritzy spray. Um, and oh my goodness, this is the nicest smell. It's apple and honeysuckle. And this is the nicest smell I've ever had. Oh, it's gorgeous. I, I absolutely love it. This is so nice. As you can see, <laughs> I quite like it. It's really, it is really, really nice. And I'm definitely going to get uh, two or three of those next time I get my Avon book. Looks like this. It's so, it's so fresh. It's lovely. It really is a lovely smell. So apple and honeysuckle. Honestly, guys, I really recommend that. It's gorgeous. Okay, so the next and last thing I got from Avon is the Avon Care Lip Balm. Now, this is not a bullet, and I prefer this. It's in a tube like this, and it's got one of those applicators, you know, like guys like that. And I prefer this. It comes out, and you can just... It's so nice to put on. And so much easier than a bullet. So much easier than a bullet. You do have to wipe it every time, otherwise your lipstick's on it. But it is really nice. I've had that a couple of times, particularly during the winter. So I should keep that every day. My lips are so dry. It's all the central heating. Okay, so the next things are from here, there and everywhere. Nowhere in particular. So I'll just say where I think I remember where I bought them. Right. <laughs> so this is Superdrug. Um, this is a natural whole hair spray. That'll do me fine. I don't use a lot of hairspray, especially in the winter, because um, 
again central heating anything that makes anything slightly dry i don't use but this is a fine one and it's only a natural hold it's not sort of a heavy hold so i just put a little bit around here and you know on the ends but that one will do me fine the next thing i've got from super drug is the spun the cotton wool pads now i like the oval ones I only like the oval ones. My favourite ones are the PS ones from Primark. I absolutely adore them. But I haven't been into town. So I've got these. And the reason I like them for a couple of reasons. One of the reasons is that I think there's obviously more surface area. So you can get, you know, do a little bit more cleaning with it. I find these ones a little bit tougher. You know, I don't mean tougher on your face. I mean, not falling apart so much. And they don't do that fleecing. And also, my container, my um, Perspex container in the bathroom is that shape. <laughs> so I stick to the oval ones. Uh, next thing I've got, anything else from there? No. Next thing I got was from my local chemist. And this is my favourite top coat. It's from Binky. And it's a line... Does anybody watch The Only Way to Chelsea? No, it's The Only Way to Essex, isn't it? Made in Chelsea. That's it, Made in Chelsea. I don't really watch her a lot, but I do like her cosmetic line. Um, one of the girls in it is Binky, and she bought her many years. I don't think she's been in it for some years. I'm not sure, because I don't watch it now. But anyway, she bought her own cosmetic line, and that's really nice if you see it, guys. It's quite reasonably priced, but that is a real bulletproof top coat, and I love it. I've got to show you these from Superdrug. These are the roll-ons that are on offer at the moment. Buy them, two get one free. So I've got three different flavour flavours, as if you eat a roll-on. Um, I've got soft pink, crystal, and sensitive. And I like those. Those are the uh as does no superdrug. I'm confusing myself. Now, what else have I got? Nope. All the other things I've got now are from an online company called Fragrance Direct. And you know that I love Derma B. You know I love Derma B. So I've tried something. Let me just read this because honestly, if I'm saying this right, it's a facial cognac sponge. It's pure, pure vegetable fibre, eco-friendly, Biodegradable, chemical free, handmade, and vegan friendly. I've seen lots of videos talking about a cognac sponge. <laughs> Not saying it right. It's like a brick at the moment, but apparently it really soaks up the water. And it's for your face. And I was just wondering how it would work. I know a lot of them. Um, a lot of ladies like it. I've never tried one ever before. So I'm going to give that a shot and I'll tell you, you know, how I get on with it when if I like it. It looks good. It looks, you know, the sort of thing that the ladies are using on the video. So we'll give it a try. Next thing is now. Dermavie again, which I love. I got the Marcella water. So that's that one. If I'm going to do a fragrance direct uh, shop, I normally get as much Derma V stuff as I can in. And this is the Marcella Cleansing Wash. I still cannot get hold of CeraVe. I honestly, the only thing I can think is it's coming to, you know, it's not been in the UK long. And I guess it's coming and everybody's going to start raving mad and bought it all up. That's all I can think of. Um, but it's not available. It's not available on the website because Boots is the only place that sells it. No, I think Super Drug Gym now as well do uh, CeraVe. But, um, it's, neat, it's not available in either of those, but as soon as that comes in, I'm going to stock up on that. But meantime, of course, I've got to wash my face. So at the moment, that the moment I'm using the Garnier, um, and this one is the Marcella Cleansing Wash from Derma B. So I'm going to try that when that, the Garnier's run out. Okay, so more from Derma B10. This is the 10 Years Younger Deep Wrinkle Collagen Filler. I've used this before and I like it very much. Um, I do for the, this time of year as well when, the, you know, our face is very dry. 10 Years Younger sponsored this. It was a, a programme 
we had and I used to love it. They used to um, get a lady, put her in a capsule in, in the shopping centre, ask everybody how old they thought she was. It was like a survey. And then 10 days later, they would go in and see, after they did their jobs and all the professionals did their work, um, they put her back in the capsule and see what people said then. And they would see if they could do it with 10 years, see if they could make the difference 10 years. It was such a good program. And some of the transformations just took your breath away. It was, it, I used to love that program. Anyway, that's, they, 10 years younger got a brand out and that, um, made with Derma V and I love it. Love it, love it. I got two of the balance. You know I like balance. Another one I like. This is the Snake Venom, Venom Eye Cream. I've been using this for ages and ages. So they've changed your packaging, guys. It used to be black. Ooh, but it's pink now. Pretty, really. <laughs> um, looks very similar, though. It's so good, guys. I, I always use it. And I, then I, sometimes I stop and I lapse. And I can see the difference, you know, when I haven't... Um, being a naughty girl but keep using this yes i will it's the best eye cream for me that and the ordinary caffeine under my eyes is the answer and next is now this guys is absolutely blowing my mind this is the derma b makeup brush cleanser now i do my brushes every saturday as you know and I wash them with a antibacterial soap and then I use one of those little things with the patterns on, you know, to rub your brush on and um, rinse thoroughly and then I just dry them naturally. Um, but sometimes there's still a little mark or a little stain the same way as there is on my beauty blender. Sometimes it's a, you know, something really pigmented and it hasn't quite come out so forth. This takes every single, they come up like a new brush. I can't believe it. Derma V10 Makeup Brush Cleaner and you need the tiniest little bit. So you put a tiny little bit in your hand. That's what I do anyway. I put a tiny little bit in my hand. Or you can put some sort of a little egg cup size thing if you're doing eye brushes. Wet the brush. Just put a little bit on. Tap it in. Put a little bit of that in. And then get your cleaner and rub it on your cleaner, rinse it off. It's all gone. It's such a good cleanser. I honestly, I am blown away by this. I love it. So back to my challenge of lighting. <laughs> this, this, at the moment I'm in the spare room, which I did my last video. I filmed my last video and I don't know if it'd be the last one that went up, but the I filmed my last video and it was nice. It was quite good. But this side is so dark. And I think it still is. But I've borrowed my husband's uh, painting light because he paints. So I've borrowed his painting light and I've, light and I've got it behind the camera. So I don't know if that's helped at all. Um, brighten things at all. But uh, I'm just testing. Give me time, guys. You know I'm not a techno -wiz. Be patient with me. <laughs> Thank you so much. I really want to learn. I do really want to learn how to do things properly. Um, but I'll do my best in the meantime. So I'll see you all soon. See you in my next video. Take great care of yourselves. And thank you for being here, guys. Thank you so much for your support. And I know I say it again and again, but you blow me away. You do. You really do. Thank you so much. Love you all. Bye. Bye.